Let's have a look at this uh, definite integration. So in this question, they're asking us to calculate the definite integral from x equals 1 until x equals 7 of the function 2x plus 1 with respect to x. So for this, uh, we're going to first start by using some of our definite integral rules to split this up and make it easier for ourselves. So with uh, our definite integral rules, it tells us that whenever I'm adding uh, two functions inside of an integration like this, I can split them up into their own separate integrals. So I can split this up into 2x dx plus the integral of 1 to 7 of 1 dx. I also have a rule that says if I have a number, just a constant multiplying a function inside of a, an integration, I can remove the constant out front of the integral. So I can take this 2 out and this becomes 1 7 x dx plus the integral from 1 to 7 of 1 dx. And now that I have it in this form, I can actually calculate these two um, definite integrals by just using our formulas for anti-differentiation. So this becomes 2, and then the antiderivative of x is 1 half x squared. And I'm going to evaluate that from 1 until 7. And then this becomes the antiderivative of 1, which is just x, and I'm going to evaluate that from 1. 7. So um, what this 1 and 7 mean is that I should plug in 7 into this function, which becomes 1 half 7 squared, minus what I get when I plug 1 into this function, which is 1 half times 1 squared. And then this function here, what I do is I do the same thing. I plug in 7, so this becomes 7, and then I plug in, I subtract off what I get when I plug in 1, which is just 1. So now this becomes 2 times 1 half times 49 minus 1 half because 1 squared is just 1 plus 6. Now these, this 2 cancels out this 1 half and this 1 half. So this becomes 49 minus 1 plus 6. And at the end of the day, when I add all these three numbers up, I get 49 plus 5, which is just 54, which is the final answer.